Hi. Welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team gives you an analysis with the information we got during our half trading day of August 1, 2019. Our objective is to give you alternatives to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. SP500 ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. We show you the Dow Jones Industrial ETF and it belongs to the bear high class. Our analysis shows you a strong opportunity to buy. We are expecting a buy return of 1.6%. This top opportunity has a maximum buy price of $269.95 but we expect a possible buy price of $265.61. NASDAQ 100 ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the market sectors table. There is a strong opportunity to buy energy sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 2.2%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $62.23, but we expect a possible buy price of $60.68. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to sell. We show you the energy sector ETF and it belongs to the bear normal class. Our analysis shows you a strong opportunity to buy. We are expecting a buy return of 2.2%. This top opportunity has a maximum buy price of $62.23. But we expect a possible buy price of $60.68. Let's look at the stocks table of energy sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy AOG resources. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 9.5%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $84.62, but we expect a possible buy price of $81.33. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Baker Hughes Company. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 10.4%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $24.16, but we expect a possible sell price of $25.68. Financial sector ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of financials sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy BlackRock. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 6.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $469.82, but we expect a possible buy price of $455.19. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Bank of America. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.3%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $30.87, but we expect a possible sell price of $31.41. BlackRock is a strong new buy alternative. It is on a bear high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it is given an average buy return of 0.8%. You may expect now a buy return of 6.0%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $469.82.
but we expect a possible buy price of $455.19. In addition, we suggest to invest a maximum of 12.5% of your capital if you decide to buy it. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the bare normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of healthcare sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Pfizer Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 21.3%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $41.54, but we expect a possible buy price of $37.66. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to sell. Pfizer Incorporated is a strong new buy alternative. It is on a bare low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 4.9%. You may expect now a buy return of 21.3%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $41.54. But we expect a possible buy price of $37.66. In addition, we suggest to invest a maximum of 12.5% of your capital if you decide to buy it. Industrial sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of industrials sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Boeing company. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 5.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $348.72, but we expect a possible buy price of $332.81. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Union Pacific. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.3%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $179.45, but we expect a possible sell price of $182.07. Materials sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of materials sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy air products chemicals. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 2.8%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $227.68, but we expect a possible buy price of $220.76. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Sherwin-Williams. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 0.6%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $496.07, but we expect a possible sell price of $527.03. Discretionary sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of discretionary sector. There is a mild opportunity to buy Netflix Incorporated. 
you can observe, it has an expected buy return of 10.8%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $318.17, but we expect a possible buy price of $311.63. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell General Motors. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.2%. You may sell at a minimum price of $40.91, but we expect a possible sell price of $41.81. McDonald's is a strong new buy alternative. It is on a bear high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.7%. You may expect now a buy return of 6.3%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $214.26, but we expect a possible buy price of $207.26. In addition, we suggest to invest a maximum of 12.5% of your capital if you decide to buy it. We show you the Consumer Staples ETF and it belongs to the trade low class. Our analysis shows you a mild opportunity to buy. We are expecting a buy return of 2.1%. This top opportunity has a maximum buy price of $59.96, but we expect a possible buy price of $59.16. Let's look at the stocks table of Staples sector. There is a mild opportunity to buy Philip Morris. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 7.9%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $85.72, but we expect a possible buy price of $83.73. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to sell. Technology sector ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of technology sector. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell NVIDIA Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.5%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $168.11, but we expect a possible sell price of $178.24. Oracle Corporation is a strong new buy alternative. It is on a bear high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 2.8%. You may expect now a buy return of 6.5%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $57.51, but we expect a possible buy price of $54.47. In addition, we suggest to invest a maximum of 12.5% of your capital if you decide to buy it. Communication sector ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of communication sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy T-Mobile US. 
you can observe, it has an expected buy return of 15.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $79.84, but we expect a possible buy price of $77.14. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell AT&T. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.1%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $34.89, but we expect a possible sell price of $35.16. Utilities sector ETF belongs to the bare normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of utilities sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Duke Energy. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 6.2%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $88.21 but we expect a possible buy price of $85.2. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Southern Company. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 1.2%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $56.81 but we expect a possible sell price of $56.94. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good update of our half trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.